This is a tutorial taking you through the premium setup with Simply IDX 3.0 that we offer for WordPress websites. After installing and activating the Simply IDX 3.0 theme, we'll start by building the home page. In this case, we want an image slider at the top. The template that has a similar one to this is Casabella. So we'll search for Casabella and add the header with slider. Then we'll edit it to look however we want. Then we want to add three styled boxes with links to the main pages of the website. They look like the sweet home template call to action, so that's what we'll select, but we want three side by side. First, we'll drag that module, then we'll relabel it and change the background color. We'll also add some padding, get rid of the image icon, and set up a link here. Now let's change the color of that link as well, and the font, and once we have it just right, we'll duplicate those boxes and update the text and links for the other two. Once we have those three boxes ready, we want some neighborhood links with some saved links from IDX Broker. They look like Fine Homes featured pages. So we'll pull that module in from the save section, and we'll first decide how we want to style each neighborhood. We'll put in some links for homes and condos to start, add a background, colors, and change the font. Then we'll change the photo. And we'll size this to suit the photo better. We'll add a title and center it. So then we're gonna duplicate and drag this row and duplicate it again with both to create a grid. Use those rows to change the number of modules across if needed. And we'll change the photos for the other neighborhoods to suit them. Then those links for homes and condos can all be set up with IDX Broker safe links. After that, we'll make a small section with featured properties that looks like the IDX Zen sidebar widget. So we'll search for and drag that saved module in, add a title,
and we're gonna use that two column option to shift the properties over so that we can add some descriptive text as well. You can play with the spacing of the modules here. And we'll add a background color for each section to match the site branding. The header we're going to set up for this website is nothing like the samples Simply IDX has pre-made, but that's no problem since with Beaver Builder Themer that comes only with the premium setup, we can build one custom easily with a drag and drop interface. So we're going to go into Beaver Builder and then Themer Layouts and create a custom header layout. For the location, make sure you switch that to entire site. Once we launch Beaver Builder, we'll set up a logo in the top left, social media icons in the top right linked to those social media accounts and contact information next to the logo. We can play around with the formatting until we find what we like and save it when we have something good to start with. Next, we'll set up a navigation menu so we can format that into our custom header as well. And once we're happy with that, we'll move on to the footer. You can set up your navigation menu under Menus in WordPress. For the footer, we'll just make something simple, similar to the Fine Homes one. The editing process for the footer is pretty much the same as the header, so we'll go ahead and skip that for now. And here's the finished site at CancunRealEstateSearch.com. If you have questions about setting up a Simply IDX site or anything else related to IDX broker website configuration, please contact us at support at realtycandy.com or 435-222-5522. Thank you.